a lot of parents that are separated and, and, and struggling a lot of the time. Parenting is the hardest job you ever do and really is a full-time job for two parents. So, you know, ease up on yourself if you're parenting on your own. It's tough and you really need to access support and help, you know, from time to time uh, just to look after yourself well. So what are the things I suppose that come up around when separated couples visit me? One of the things I suppose is really around your relationship with your ex and maybe ensuring that the child doesn't get caught in the crossfire of that. And I understand that there's only so much that you can do because invariably it's not always up to you. But as far as possible, I think it is important not to speak ill of your ex in front of the child, not to use that child as a messenger, not to use that child as a pawn, not to use that child as a therapist. Sit with your ex and try to set up a plan, you know, around the child and the child's needs. I think it's really important also that if new people come into either, either, either person's life, that uh, the other ex needs to hear about that because otherwise the child may know about it but feel they can't say it to you. So things like new arrangements or if somebody has met a new partner or whatever, all of that, or there might be somebody that is pregnant or a baby due, all of that is really important that it's sensitively handled so that both partners are able to support the child around managing change. What we're finding is that it isn't just the breakup of the relationships that's creating the difficulties, it's the speed of the new relationships and children do need help managing that.